Hello, oh, hey, so we have this TV. It's a Vizio Plasma TV and it doesn't work. It's a VP50 HD TV20A. That's the model number of it. It's an older plasma TV. My son and his friends were down here playing videos on it and stuff and it just wasn't working anymore. Um, you see the no lights on it. I press the power button on the side of the TV hit the power button on the remote and nothing happens absolutely nothing so we're gonna take the back panel off this kind of look through it see if there's something that even a novice like myself can fix um, before you do take it apart though make sure you unplug it for a while because there's a lot of capacitors in the back of this thing that holds power for a while and you want to hit the button for about 10 seconds or so make sure the capacitors have a chance to discharge and I would leave it unplugged for a while before you actually get into it. I don't claim to be an expert. I'm just letting you know what I've found. Uh, take it at your own risk, I guess. But make sure it's not, you unplug it and then hit the power button to try to discharge it to make sure that it indeed does not work. Yo, yo, YouTube. Okay, to check the continuity of the fuse, you want to just go ahead and see if this makes a I'm measuring ohms so if this makes a connection you see the ohms go very low almost a zero and open line means open line so if I test a fuse I go across this then it goes down very low that means it has completed the circuit across that and basically as I went through and I it's hard to catch up with this thing as I went through and I tested the different fuses, one of the fuses had an open line in it. So I knew that it wasn't conducting electricity through that fuse. So we're going to go ahead and uh, change the fuses. All right, looking on the back of the board here, there's four different fuses. There's one here and one here. And this one over on this side I took out. Whoops, I can't see it. My hand's in the way. Um, that was the one that uh, was actually blown. And these are the power wires coming in. Um, and there's also one up here. And there's another one right there. So we're going to replace those four fuses. And it costs like six bucks for the fuses. And hopefully that will fix it. All right, so we got it all put back together now. We put the back on it. And it was fairly easy to take it apart and put back together. And now we're going to see if those fuses actually fixed it. Um, we plugged it in we saw the power light comes on that's probably a good um, sign so I hit the remote here see if that works click hey green light green lights good right uh, <gasps> there it is we fixed it and you know what those fuses cost six bucks I was getting ready to throw this TV out and my wife says hey why don't you try to fix the thing you're pretty good at fixing stuff right so I got, so got in there, and I think it was Yogi Berra used to say, you know, you can see a lot by looking. And uh, so I got in there and started looking around and say, hey, these fuses, this one fuse is bad. And let's go ahead and replace all four of them, $6, instead of throwing this TV out. Now it works. Man, it is awesome. Anyways, um, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.